Oh boy. Amazing news. Looks like the rumor of Donkey Kong coming back to Hollywood is back on again. And it's amazing. Let's go dive down into this rumor and also check out Jammy's channel for a full fan-made POV of this coaster. It's incredible. I'll link it in the description below. The full POV link. Watch it. But let's discuss this potential rumor right now. Alright, so yes, I was browsing the interwebs and I was on the W or the Inside Universal forums and according to Jim Hill and some sources inside the Inside Universal forums, they're hearing that Donkey Kong uh Universal executives want to put Donkey Kong Country inside Universal Hollywood by 2025 to coincide with Epic Universe's opening. And if true, that would be fantastic on so many levels. One, because the much bigger Super Nintendo World will be opening, of course, in Florida. So, Hollywoods won't look so puny if they have, we have Donkey Kong Country as well. We'll only be missing one ride, which basically turned into the sequel for pets, which would be amazing. Two, we'll have varying levels of coasters for everybody, right? We'll have, you know, Flight of the Hippogriff as the kitty coaster. We'll have Mummy there as a family coaster. Donkey Kong as a family coaster. Mom, Mummy's still on the chopping block. And we'll have Fast and Furious as the high-speed thrill coaster. Now, as far as locations, obviously, the lower lot is where it would be. But whether it be on the sound stages behind Mummy, on top of Mummy, Mummy or the location next to Super Nintendo World, those sound stages where the voice is and those two other ones, I'm not sure. That was not mentioned in the rumor, but if I were to choose, I would choose those sound, if they can fit it, those sound stages next to Super Nintendo World because it's obviously next to Super Nintendo World. Now, even if we don't get the whole Donkey Kong Country land, if we just get the coaster, that's good enough for me. As it would add yet another attraction to Hollywood's lineup without replacing anything. And another coaster, as we uh, just discussed with three Kobe, three, four varying levels of coasters, which would be amazing. And it couldn't, shouldn't be that difficult to punch a little hole inside the existing Super Nintendo World to connect to Donkey Kong Country. You can see here in this Google map that the sound stages I'm talking about, it is those two long skinny ones to the left hand side and then you see the voice sound stage is down at the bottom that is kind of already kind of already being torn up um but yeah that is actually the former voice sound stage the voice that moved to a different sound stage but that would be my location but again it can go on top of transformers maybe in the uh, sound stages by mummy not sure and beware this is just a rumor and yes, if this rumor is to be believed that um, it would be coming in 2025, which means they'd have to kind of start quickly, definitely by next year, but would, would Universal really be building Fast and Furious and Donkey Kong Country at the same exact time? I mean, they are hungry and ferocious, so I wouldn't doubt it, but would they start voting before Super Nintendo World opened? That I'm not sure about. They may want to wait until it's done, but with soft openings rumored to be in January for Nintendo, they could potentially, again, maybe they could start construction Fast and Furious maybe in January, and then in the summertime, or also in January, or just sometime early next year, have the uh, Super Net or Donkey Kong Country start construction for its opening in 2025. That could be a, a very real possibility. Uh, and it would be, again, fantastic. It would expand the Nintendo world. Um, it's very popular. Again, people are very excited. As I tell you in all the updated videos, they can hear people just saying, Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Also, I can see people buying a lot of merch. Even And no matter how many merchandise stores they open up, just like with Harry Potter, people are always in them buying them. I went to, you saw in the video, the newest video, checking out the new City Walk store. People were in there as packed. They were buying things. And I was went and bought that shirt myself, that new exclusive Hollywood shirt, which is fantastic. So 
If Nintendo merch sales are up, attendance is doing very well. Looking at the look at the Horror Night uh, dates remaining, most of them are sold out. Um, but if that attendance keeps up during the day and at night, and with Nintendo, uh, Nintendo merchandise sales, they might want to get Nintendo more Nintendo in here as fast as possible. So this will not be surprising if this keeps up. And again, congrats to Comcast and Universal for continuing to invest in Hollywood and the rest of the Universal Parks. Um, we saw in those latest attendance numbers, which I'll break down in another video, that Universal Parks are catching up on Disney Parks for a variety of factors in terms of attendance. But yeah, what do you guys think of this potential rumor again? It is rumor, so do, do take it with a grain of grain of salt, but it has been on again, off again for quite a few years now. The Donkey Kong rumor, but again, if those Nintendo sales open uh, open up and uh, Nintendo sales, you know, go really big and attendance continues to drive up, I, I'm sure they'll want to get more Nintendo in here as soon as possible. But another reason is because Donkey Kong, I mean, Epic Universe in Florida is so huge and Super Nintendo World will be so huge there. Hollywood will be seeing just a tiny puny one, you know, if we get... Again, if you get Nintendo in here, or Donkey Kong in here, Hollywood's land won't seem so puny and tiny and insignificant, I should say. Uh, it would be like a decent size. Let me know your thoughts on the and comments on this potential rumor of Donkey Kong coming in a few years. If you liked this video, press that thumbs up. Subscribe for more theme park updates and more rumors and updates on this rumor, as well as Super Nintendo World construction updates from Epic Universe and here in Hollywood, and Fast and Furious Coaster updates as well. And as always, have a fantastic day.